Let me ask you a question. When was the last time you scheduled a guilt-free day where you could add some self-care in, hang out with a good friend, just catch up on life and not worry about stress or work or any of that? How long has it been? So one thing that I did differently in 2021 after reevaluating my life and realizing that I did not have enough of those self-care days in or days that I could just have this guilt-free reward and hang out with friends and, and be able to just enjoy life was scheduling those priorities. And I started to make it a habit. My best friend and I started putting hikes into our monthly schedule. We'd choose one day out of the month completely block it off from work, from kids, from all of that, and just hang out together. It was good for my soul. It was good for my spirit. It was good for my legs, <laughs> hiking up mountains, and it was good to just reconnect with her. So let me ask you, when was the last time that you scheduled one of those self-care days or a day where you could just get away from work and hang out with your friends and family and do nothing at all except enjoy the company around you and live in the moment? We need to do more of that. So many of us are really struggling with work-life balance and trying to find that perfect harmony, but that perfect harmony will only come from you. And that's when you start scheduling your priorities and sticking to it and making the commitment. This is Rule of Life lesson number 136 in my series. And if you want to read more about this story and how I changed up my lifestyle starting in January, then read it on my blog at tishamarieenterprises.com slash blog or follow along with all my adventures at hashtag Tisha Talks. We'll see you back next Monday. Bye-bye.